set into the back wall right here. And you try to keep your fingers off that Chromex wire if you can. Not necessary, but it's always good that you do. Well, the oil on your fingers will make it stink when it comes off. What makes them stink is when they've been in there for years and they got oil and grease all over them. Then when it comes on, boy, do they get hot. That wire will start to glow red and then it's all over. Yeah. Whatever's on it will be burned. So when you, um, I guess, is that when you turn on the heat? If you the, turn on the supplemental heat. The emergency heat? Emergency, emergency heat, heat will turn that on. Or if you turn your thermostat up over two degrees of what the indoor temperature is. Okay. Say it's 60 in the house and you want to run it up to 65. Well, that's okay. five degrees over what the temperature in the home is. We'll turn on the heat pump okay. and that heat strip. Okay. Now, as the temperature comes up in the home, the thermostat will know that. And then when it gets to, you set it at 65, well, when it hits 63 degrees, because it's warmed up from 60 to 63, it'll turn off the strip. Okay. Then it runs on the heat pump until it goes mm -hmm. on to its full shutoff at whatever temperature you yeah. set it for. And the heating elements are right in with the plenum. So the air just goes right past it? Yes, this blower up. right here. See how big this blower is? Look, yeah. at the di look at the diameter of this blower. Yeah. It's a monster. And then look at all the wires that feed it. Mm -hmm. Variable speed. Excellent. Ramps up and down. So that should save me some money, right? And then the yeah. coil is aluminum. Uh -huh. which That's means the evaporator. That is the evaporator coil. Mm -hmm. It is made of aluminum, which will never rust, mm -hmm. deteriorate, or go bad. You have a internal pan for water right there. Mm -hmm. What that does is it catches the water that the coil produces, yeah. runs it out the drain line, dumps it outside. Okay. Lennox has come up with a drain pan that has antimicrobial plastic is made of, which means it's like Teflon. Mm -hmm. That pan is very slick. If you put your fingers on it, you'll feel that it's very, very slick. And mm -hmm. none of your ordinary um, materials, as far as yes, dirt, sir. grease, grime, hair, everything that will get into a unit will not stay in that pan. Mm -hmm. It will automatically go right on out the drain line down there. Because mm -hmm. it's a very good way what they've done. They made a very smart thing when it came to that. That's pretty simple. Just got it's four all screws. Simple. If yeah. you see somebody do it, yeah. it's all pretty easy. Oh, when you know what you're doing. Yeah. <laughs> Just like surgery, right? Yeah. Brain surgery. <laughs> okay. Let me get this in office a little bit. 